In the Avatar comics, Ursa returns home where her mother informs her of a surprise guest in the greenhouse. She opens the door and immediately falls to her knees as we see that the surprise guest is Fire Lord Azulon who asks her to stand up so he can get a good look at her. He compliments Ursa's looks and reveals that her family are the late Avatar Roku's descendants. The Fire Sages predicted that a pairing between the Avatar and the Fire Lord's bloodline would produce heirs of great power, so Azulon sought out Ursa to introduce her to his second son, the Fire Prince Ozai. Ursa has no choice but to accept this proposal and leaves with the Fire Lord and the Prince before the royal carriage is stopped by none other than Ikum, who refuses to let the Fire Lord take away his true love. The guards laugh since he's carrying prop swords, but even so, Ikum is able to hold his own quite well. Ursa pleads with Ozai to call the guards off so she can personally get him to leave and comes out of the carriage to talk. To save Ikum's life, Ursa lies through her teeth and says that the Prince has asked for her hand in marriage and she has happily accepted. She tells Ikum to go home and leaves him absolutely devastated.